AMC 2021 problem 6, we have these two people hiking and we want to find one of the person's average speed in miles per hour. Now, since we're trying to find the average speed, which is the velocity, that would be equal to the total distance that she traveled divided by the time that she traveled. Now, for the sake of generality, we're going to suppose that this is the distance that they traveled. And this is the halfway point, and we're going to let this total distance to be x. x can be any number. So given this information, how are we supposed to calculate this information? Well, to calculate it, we can first start off by calculating the time that it took for Chandler to walk the entire path. Chandler's time will be equal to the distance divided by her velocity. So since for the first half, she traveled at 4 miles per hour, x over 2 divided by 4 will be the first half of the amount of time that she took. Now, going the second half, she traveled at 2 miles per hour climbing a steep hill, so x over 2 divided by 2. Coming back to the halfway point, she traveled at 3 miles per hour, so x over 2 divided by 3. This is equal to x over 8, this is equal to x over 4, but this is equal to x over 6. Now we sum them up and we will get to the total amount of time that it took Chantel to walk her path. Combine these two first, 3x over 8 plus x over 6. Combine these two, we get 48 and then 26x. Simplify, we get 13x over 24. Now, since the velocity is equal to the distance of Jean divided by the time of Jean, well, how much time did it take Jean to travel from here to here? Well, the time that she took was the time that it took Chantel to walk from here to here, from here to here, and then all the way from the end point to the midpoint. So therefore, we calculated the amount of time that it took uh, Jean to walk the halfway point. So therefore, the velocity, the average velocity of Jean would be the distance that she traveled, x over 2, divided by her time, which is 13x over 24. Simplify x over 2 times 12 or 24 over 13x. X and X gets canceled. We simplify. This becomes 12, which is equal to 12 over 13, and bring ourselves to answer choice A.